The Bolsheviks, also known as the Russian Social Democratic Labor Party RSDLP, were a revolutionary group that played a pivotal role in the Russian Revolution of 1917. Led by Vladimir Lenin, the Bolsheviks overthrew the provisional government and established the world's first socialist state. In this video, we will explore what the Bolsheviks did and how their actions shaped the course of Russian and world history. The Bolsheviks emerged from the RSDLP, which was founded in 1898 as a Marxist party. However, the party was split into two factions in 1903, the Bolsheviks and the Mensheviks, over differences in strategy and tactics. The Bolsheviks believed in a more militant and centralized approach to revolution, while the Mensheviks favored a more gradual and democratic approach. Under the leadership of Lenin, the Bolsheviks became the dominant faction of the RSDLP by the outbreak of World War I. Lenin opposed the war, arguing that it was an imperialist conflict that would only benefit the ruling classes. He also believed that the war would create the conditions for a revolutionary uprising, as the working class would be pushed to the brink of desperation. The February Revolution of 1917 was sparked by a series of protests and strikes in Petrograd. The demonstrations were fueled by food shortages, rising prices, and opposition to the war effort. On February 23, International Women's Day, a group of female workers led a protest march that sparked wider demonstrations. The protests quickly turned into a general strike, with workers from across the city joining in. The provisional government, which had been formed after the abdication of Tsar Nicholas II, was unable to contain the unrest. The government was weak and divided, and it lacked the legitimacy and support needed to quell the protests. The Bolsheviks, who had been building support among the working class and the soldiers, seized the opportunity to push for a revolution. Lenin, who had been in exile in Switzerland, returned to Russia in April 1917. He immediately began working to consolidate Bolshevik power and prepare for a takeover of the government. Lenin argued that the provisional government was a bourgeois government that represented the interests of the wealthy elite, and that only a socialist government could meet the needs of the working class and the peasants. On October 25, 1917, the Bolsheviks launched their revolution. They stormed the Winter Palace, the seat of the provisional government, and arrested its members. The Bolsheviks declared the formation of a new government, the Council of People's Commissars, with Lenin as its head. The new government was based on the principles of socialism and workers' control of the means of production. The October Revolution was not universally supported. The Bolsheviks faced opposition from other political parties including the Mensheviks and the Socialist Revolutionaries, as well as from members of the middle and upper classes. The new government also faced challenges from within, as different factions within the Bolsheviks vied for power and influence. The Bolsheviks' seizure of power sparked a civil war that lasted from 1918 to 1921. The war was fought between the Bolsheviks and a coalition of anti-Bolshevik forces, including monarchists, nationalists, and foreign powers. The war was brutal and costly, with millions of lives lost and significant damage to the economy and infrastructure. The Bolsheviks were ultimately victorious, thanks in large part to their superior organization and discipline. The Bolsheviks also benefited from the support of the working class and the peasantry, who saw the Bolsheviks as their champions. The Bolshevik government was able to establish control over the entire territory of the former Russian Empire, which had been shattered by the war and the collapse of the Tsarist regime. During the Civil War, the Bolsheviks implemented a range of policies to consolidate their power and address the challenges facing the country. One of the most significant of these policies was war communism, which was implemented in 1918. War communism involved the nationalization of industry, the requisitioning of grain and other foodstuffs from the peasantry, and the establishment of a centralized economy. The policy was aimed at mobilizing resources for the war effort, but it had severe consequences for the population, 
leading to widespread famine and hardship. The Bolsheviks also faced challenges from nationalist movements, particularly in Ukraine and the Caucasus. These movements sought greater autonomy or independence from the new Soviet government, which they saw as an oppressive force. The Bolsheviks responded with military force, leading to further violence and instability. After the end of the Civil War, the Bolsheviks turned their attention to building a new society. In 1922, the Soviet Union was formed, bringing together the former Russian Empire and several neighboring territories. The new state was based on the principles of socialism and workers' control of the means of production. The Soviet Union under the Bolsheviks underwent significant social and economic changes. The Bolsheviks implemented a program of industrialization, with the aim of catching up with the more advanced capitalist countries. The state invested heavily in heavy industry, such as steel and coal production, and established a planned economy to coordinate production and distribution. The Bolsheviks also implemented a program of social reforms, aimed at improving the lives of the working class and the peasantry. These reforms included the nationalization of land, the establishment of free education and health care, and the promotion of women's rights. However, the Soviet Union under the Bolsheviks was also marked by repression and political violence. The Bolsheviks saw themselves as engaged in a struggle for survival against internal and external enemies, and they were willing to use force to maintain their power. Political opposition was suppressed, dissenting voices were silenced, and dissidents were subjected to imprisonment and execution. In 